Good morning, everyone. Fishing a new lake this morning. This is Madison Lake near London, Ohio. Uh, not sure what to think. We had a lot of rain last night, so the water's kind of stained up a little bit. Um, we are probably right in the middle of the spawn, so it'll be a challenging day. New lake, I don't know where anything is. Uh, the fish are going to be tough on the spawn, and there's muddy water, so quite a challenge. Let's go see what we can do. Okay, I am about 15 minutes into this thing. I'm over here fishing along the dam. You see the spillways right over there. At the spring sale, I bought a little red crankbait. So I decided to take it out and throw it around the rocks here. Very first cast I made with this thing, I hooked a little crappie. So, not real impressed with Madison Lake yet. It, uh, it looks like it should be fishy, um, just, I don't know, I'm not feeling it. The muddy water has me a little bit off, but uh, I'm going to work it. I'm going to be here all day. We'll see what's happening. I always like it when I come to a lake and there's fog on the water like this. It kind of gives it a, not a spooky feel, but it's kind of a mysterious feel. Um, and it's fun. It's different scenically. But uh, just a little mist on the water. Uh, I see a little cove right back there I'm going to go into. Um, throwing my rattle trap out here in open water. And I'm really not getting any bumps at all. Been a really slow start, so keep going. Now, I've never personally done this before. I've heard of people catching them this way. Uh, I was out here targeting bass, throwing a little black ribbon tail worm Texas rig with a little weight on it, and this crappie bit my uh, worm. Um, first time for me, um, and my second fish of the day. Uh, been pretty slow. I was cruising by out there on the main lake, and I looked back in here and saw this cove just littered with lily pads. And I thought, finally, a place to catch a bass. So I came back in here and Tied on my little green stick worm, and um, nothing, not a bump, nothing. I'm beginning to wonder if there are any bass in this lake. Um, I see a lot of crappie moving. I've caught two crappie, but uh, just not seeing the bass movement. All righty, finally, after about two and a half, three hours, uh, throwing my little spook. Uh, and got this guy right here off the see right off the nose that little patch of grass weeds whatever he came up and busted it he's about maybe 13 inches my shoe is 13 so yeah he's 13 inches not quite a pound but it's fish finally it's a fish Tell you what, this has been a slow day, um, but throwing my little uh, lipless crankbait, that little sexy shad, got this guy, he's about 14, 15 inches, maybe he's about a pound, tick over. Nice fish though. So that's number five in the boat. Got kind of a unique situation right here. We just came out of a real shallow area back there where we kind of lost track of the channel. And then I've come back in here and I've got pads on both sides, but the channel that I'm sitting in is so deep that I can't touch the bottom with my paddle. So uh, we're kind of excited about this little area, thinking we're gonna catch some fish. Cody just caught one, uh, but I think we're gonna work this pretty good for a while. 
All right, after a long dry spell, I switched uh, my crankbait from a sexy shad to a blue and chrome. And boom, got this guy on the second cast. That's number eight. And Cody has, what do you have, 10 or 11? 11. 11. What do you have, Tom? One. All right. There's number nine in the boat. That's short, but little fat fish. So the takeaway from today is that this lake uh, down here on the south end is lake fishing. You get up in the channel up on the north end and it's like creek or river fishing. So it's kind of cool that it's split up like that. Um, I still don't have any idea whether there are any big fish here. Uh, it seemed to me that all the fish were, you know, less than two pounds. Uh, we did see a lot of movement and some bass up in the creek channel up in the north end, which is where I will concentrate my efforts next time. But all in all, I had fun today. It was, uh, uh, let's see, 17, 12, that's 29, and he had four. He had four. So that's 33 fish. That's not a bad day. Not a bad day at all. We'll try it again next time.